with 20 professional wins, including the 2021 U.S. Open and the 2023 Masters, John Rahm has established himself as one of the best players in world golf. Not only does he wow the fans on the golf course, but even his lifestyle off the green is equally as impressive. You don't want to miss out on this golf champion, so let's dig in. Rahm was born in November 1994 in Baraka, Basque Country, Spain, to his parents Eduardo Rahm and Angela Rodriguez as the younger of two children. From when he was a child, you could tell that John was a champion in the making. It might have been a bit hard to predict he'd be a champion on the golf course, but his competitive spirit was definitely a tale of how successful he could be in any sport. Even when playing soccer in their neighborhood in Baraka, John played as a goalkeeper and would get angry during the games. In fact, little John would sometimes storm off the pitch completely out of anger when he conceded a goal. That's how much he wanted to win, and it didn't end there. When Rom started playing, Playing golf when he was just seven years old, he did it with the same competitiveness. His first experience on the course came when his mom took him to the Martiartu driving range to hit some balls. But here's the thing. All that while, John never took it seriously. Yeah, he wanted to win, but it hardly crossed his mind that he'd end up with a career on the green. One could conclude that he never took it seriously because golf wasn't the only sport he was involved in as a child. John played soccer, canoeing, taekwondo, and golf all at the same time, and it wasn't until he was 11 years old that he began taking golf seriously, with golf trainers George Losada and Eduardo Celis as his first teachers. Celis particularly had been credited by Rom for helping him work on his golf swing and believing in him. John's older brother Eric also pushed him to be better, but as competitive as he was as a child, John was always calm and collected. His parents once said that he never got into fights, kept a small group of school friends, and wasn't even girl crazy. That's hard to believe given how much he's known to flare up during golf tournaments as a pro. Anyway, John had only one notable love interest in his younger years, according to Rom's dad, Adorta, although he didn't disclose her identity. John had met her in Madrid at the Bloom High Performance Center and began dating. Fun story, during that time, the young lovers decided to get into a bit of trouble and snuck out of Bloom facilities to a movie theater to see The Lion King, only to get caught. Let's just say that Rom isn't as sleek with sneaking around as he is with a golf club. Now, this doesn't mean he was any less serious or focused on his game, though. By the time he was 15 years old, he was already tearing up other amateur golfers. Rom went as far as representing Spain as an amateur. He won the 2011 European Boys Team Championship and the 2014 European Amateur Team Championship team events and the 2014 Eisenhower Trophy individually. Soon enough, he got a golf scholarship at Arizona State University, where he earned a Bachelor of Arts degree in communications. He earned a degree, but that's only one of the many things he did at Arizona State. Rom established himself as one of the college's best athletes and graduated with 11 college golf tournament wins, only second behind Phil Mickelson's 16 collegiate wins. As competitive as he is, he never did rest on his laurels, and after college he won numerous amateur tournaments before attaining the number one spot on the World Amateur Golf Ranking in 2015, a spot he retained for 60 weeks. That's well over a year if you weren't sure. It was and still is the record time spent topping the amateur rankings. Pretty impressive, right? It was the indication of things to come for Rom, who turned pro in 2016, just after the US Open, and played his first pro event at Quicken Loans National. Since then, it's been one victory after another for him. He has a total of 20 professional wins, 9 European Tour wins, and 11 PGA Tour wins, and has spent a combined 45 weeks as the number one ranked golfer on the official world golf rankings. He is now halfway to a Grand Slam in the majors with one win at the 2021 US Open and recently at the 2023 Masters. Rahm is easily one of Europe's top players to date. He was named the Sir Henry Cotton Rookie of the Year in 2019, the European Tour Golfer of the Year in 2019 and 2021, and the PGA Player of the Year in 2021. Show us a better example of a golf champion. We'll wait. Most recently in April of 2023, Rahm claimed his second major title by winning the Masters Tournament by four strokes ahead of Brooks Kepka and Phil Mickelson. This win made him only the fourth golfer from Spain to win the Masters Tournament and the first European to win the Masters and US Open. And it has also shot him all the way up to where champions belong on the official World Golf Ranking, the number one spot. With a resume as impressive as Rom's, you can tell he's getting paid well. And in actuality, the Spaniard might even be earning way more than you can think of. He's been a 
pro golfer for less than a decade and has already amassed a mouth-watering estimated net worth of $22 million. You probably want to add that to the highlight of the lifestyle of this golf champion. He's a wealthy PGA Tour player. The PGA Tour clearly pays their players handsomely, so it's no surprise that the majority of Rom's net worth is from his exploits in tournaments and events on the green. Starting from 2016, the year John turned pro, he earned an impressive $1,004,035. That's a lot to make in your rookie year. But for Rom, that's the least he has made on the course in a calendar year. The following year, 2017, saw him bring in $6,123,248 from official tournament earnings and $107,500 from unofficial tournaments, bringing his total to $6,230,748. Then $3,992,678 in 2018, a whopping $6,672,610 in 2019, but like Rom's career, it's only getting better. 2020 saw him make a total of $9,359,819 after bagging $5,959,819 on the PGA Tour, $400,000 in unofficial tournaments, and $3 million as a Tour Champion bonus. But 2021 saw another gigantic leap in earnings. He even finished the year as the PGA's leading money winner with $7,705,933 and other tournament earnings that brought his total to $16,705,933. Since then, he's made about $22 million more in earnings from the tournament payouts, $12 million in 2022 and $13 million in 2023, and the season is still young. The total of his career earnings comes to something around $69 million. That's a lot of millions. So much that Rom already ranks as 21st on the PGA all-time money list with earnings of $44 million on tour. If there was any doubt on how much of a PGA Tour star Rom is, this should clear them. But there are other ways that John Rom brings in the big checks. Like other big players, Rom has many endorsement deals with the biggest brands from around the world. Big player means big endorsements, and big endorsements mean big money. These deals include Rom's lucrative endorsement with a world-renowned automobile company, Mercedes-Benz, a software company, Blue Yonder, an apparel company, Travis Matthew, a wristwatch brand, Rolex, VistaJet, and the Silverleaf Club. He earns nearly $6 million yearly from all these endorsement deals combined. So how does a champion top up a wealthy lifestyle? For Rom, one way to do that is with acts of kindness. He's made numerous donations to the Kinzer Foundation, a foundation focused on helping children with their physical and mental health. And there's more. John Rahm also supports the Seve Ballesteros Foundation, aimed at introducing the game of golf and its values to the younger generations, a foundation of which John Rahm is actually a board member. John Rahm is also known to participate in a number of charity events, and in 2018, he donated $21,000 to the Mexican Red Cross to help victims of natural disasters. The dude's not really a car freak though, so he doesn't spend so much on cars. He does have beasts of vehicles, both Mercedes-Benz, thanks to his endorsement deal with the brand. First, his Mercedes-Benz 2019 G63, worth about $150,000, with a twin-turbo 4-liter V8 that makes 577 horsepower and 627 foot-pounds of torque, and goes from 0 to 60 in just 4 seconds. And then there's Rom's white Mercedes SLS AMG, estimated to be worth around $200,000. Just exquisite. His real estate portfolio is equally as exquisite. A four-bedroom and three-bathroom home in Arizona worth $1.6 million. The house is designed with very modern interior decor and has over 3,000 square feet of space. It has a kitchen with state-of-the-art furnishings, a comfy home office, a wine cellar, a game room, and a very spacious master bedroom. Sure enough, the mansion has a private golf course outside and even a pool and hot tub right next to it. John Rahm does know how to live in style, but he doesn't do it alone. He does it with his stunning wife, Kelly Cahill, who he met during their college days at Arizona State. Rahm was on the golf team, while Kelly was on the track and field team as a javelin thrower. She was also a top tennis player coming out of high school and was ranked as a two-star recruit after playing at a high school in Scottsdale, Arizona. After college, they lived together for two years before getting married married in December 2019 at a lovely ceremony in Bilbao, Spain near Rom's hometown of Barica. And a year later,
later, the pair announced they were expecting their first child, and just a week before the 2021 Masters in April, their first son, Keppa, was born. They welcomed another boy, Eniko Cahill Rom, in August 2022, and the whole family has been pictured at Rom's games many times. If you've ever wondered what the lifestyle of a golf champion like PGA Tour star John Rom is, there you have it. Do you agree? Let us know in the comments section below. And be sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and enjoy our other videos.